The Glass Menagerie by Tennessee Williams. My name is Laura Lozano and my presentation is an analysis of symbols. A symbol can be an object, event, word, or setting. Anything that has a deeper meaning than the surface literal meaning. The playwright uses many symbols throughout the play to reveal more depth to the characters and the situation. The symbols constantly relate to the themes of escape, abandonment, and illusion. Among the many symbols that are incorporated into the play are the fire escape, the glass collection, especially the unicorn, the photo portrait of the father, the typewriter, the movies, and Jim, the gentleman caller. Each of these represents something deeper and reveals more about the scenes and people in them. The fire escape represents a way out of the dull existence inside the apartment for Tom. Tom is trapped into being the breadwinner for the family. He is stifled by the illusionary world of his mother and sister. The son works in a warehouse, although he wants to go to far places. He wants to see distant places in the world like his father. For Laura, the fire escape is an entry to her world of fantasy. She can retreat into the apartment to escape her fears of the real world. Laura sees the fire escape as an entrance back to her safe haven inside the apartment. The fire escape is a way into the illusions of Amanda and Laura, and a way out for Tom to find the real world of his dreams. Think of the fire escape as a bridge. It leads to the outside for Tom and to the inside for Laura. Laura lives in a world of her own, a world of little glass ornaments. The glass menagerie is the most important symbol of the play, therefore the title. Laura avoids reality by totally immersing herself into her collection. The glass animals are fragile just as Laura is delicate and fragile. The glass collection represents happiness for Laura. It is her world of make-believe. The glass is, however, breakable and so is Laura. The unicorn is Laura's favorite. She identifies with the unicorn. The unicorn is different from the other horses because he has a horn and Laura sees herself as different from other people because of her limp. The broken unicorn brings a strange sense of relief to Laura. When Jim accidentally breaks off the horn of the unicorn, she sees that the animal can be like the other horses. It is no longer a creature of fantasy. Laura too can forget her limp and be normal. The photo is a reminder of the father's abandonment. This is our father who left us a long time ago. He was the telephone man who fell in love with long distances. The father deserted the family many years ago to seek his own adventures. He is the only one to escape the dire conditions. The photo is a reminder of the hard life Amanda is left with. She has had to fend for herself and her children and has no idea where her husband is. Remember, they are living in the Great Depression 
and in very difficult financial and living conditions. The photo represents possible freedom for Tom. If he can leave the family, he believes. If he can imitate his father and simply follow his desires for long distance, he will have opportunity rather than responsibility. Tom is reminded that he could too run away and free himself from his miserable job and life of too much responsibility. The typewriter symbolizes Laura's inability to cope in the real world. She is supposed to be enrolled in a business class but couldn't manage that reality. She drops out and retreats to dusting and polishing her glass collection. The typewriter represents her failure in the real world. The typewriter might be an enabler for Tom and a hope for a new future. After all, he is a poet and loves to write. The typewriter represents freedom for Tom and a better life. Adventure is something I don't have much of at work, so I, Tom, go to the movies. The movies represent a mental escape from Tom, dull job and home life. He craves the adventure stories that the cinema can offer him. Going to the movies is Tom's excuse for what is really his drinking escapades. Going to the movies is really a euphemism for going drinking. I am using Jim also as a symbol. He is the long delayed but always expected, something we live for. Tom acknowledged that Jim represents illusions of hope and happiness for both Amanda and Laura. Jim represents the reality that Laura fears and doesn't think she can face. Laura secretly admired Jim in high school and because of her infirmity felt that he could never return her admiration. Now she's paralyzed in fear of him being in her home. Jim represents the gentleman colors in Amanda's path. Jim represents Amanda's youth. She retreats into her past happiness, remembering her 17 suitors on Blue Mountain. With Jim as a color, she is back in her girlhood dream world, wearing her frilly dress and giggling in delight. The storyline in Tennessee Williams' play, The Glass Menagerie, is very simple. It is the richness of the symbolism that enhances the characters and offers insight into their thoughts and their views of life. The symbols in this play suggest a sense of unreality and a need to escape the dull day to day existence. Although I choose six symbols, there are many more in the play. Tennessee Williams has been able to convey more complicity of the story and characters by his use of symbolism. Because a symbol can have more than one meaning, there is always the possibility of different interpretations. This possibility only adds to the in-depth experience of the play. The Glass Menagerie is a valuable play on its literal level as well as its symbolic level.